I like it too, baby. What if the four-time Super Bowl champion Tom Brady had Julio Jones, Antonio Brown, DeAndre Hopkins, And Dez Bryant. Will he get a fifth Super Bowl ring? Let's find out. What's up, guys? My name is Darius P, and welcome back to another Madden 17 What If video. So, putting all of these great receivers on the Patriots only. Gives them an offensive rating of 93. Like, what? What is this, man? Anyways, man, let's get right into this. We're going to start it off. Griffin Murphy is the coach. Yeah, because Bill, <laughs> Bill Belichick still refuses to be in the game. I have no idea why, man. But we're going to skip all this nonsense, right? Okay, guys, so when I was doing when Cam Newton had all these great receivers... What I did was I changed up their playbook, right? I changed their playbook, and you guys were telling me in the comment section, I don't, what do, do I even do with that? Okay, here it is. You guys were telling me in the comment section that I should have did the spread offense. That was somebody was telling me I should have did the spread offense. So, what I'm, I'm going to do is I'm actually going to give the uh, Patriots the spread offense, or should I just keep it as the, hold on, where is it? Bro, there is no balance, pass, balance, pistol, run and shoot. Or is it here? Okay, there's the, sp <laughs> there's the spread, and I'm going to keep it <laughs> on tripping, and I'm going to keep it on uh, New England's regular playbook, right? Why not? Okay, let's do this. We're going to make sure... These auto subs are not on because we don't want them subbing. I want the quarterback. No, that's at zero. Do not. I got to make sure Tom Brady is starting too. I believe I do have him starting. I think they would. They did show Tom Brady starting. So long as Tom Brady is starting, we don't want Garoppolo in. Not, not, not in this man. Not in this. So we got Antonio Brown, DeAndre Hopkins, Julio Jones, and we got Dez Bryant over here. And then we got Grunt, and it's one of them Brandon's. I believe it's Martellius Bennett. You guys are going to roast me if that's wrong. But anyways, what we're going to do is, oh, set, we're going to set this season goal super high. Super Bowl. These boys better win the Super Bowl. Tom Brady better throw for 6,000 yards and win the Super Bowl. Hold on, guys. I could get fired. Actually, guys, if you guys don't know this, you can get fired if you similar. If you simulate and your team don't win, you can actually get a fire, y'all. So hopefully, hopefully I don't go fire. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna simulate to mid-season and see what's going on. Let's do this. Okay, guys, so halfway through the season, and the Patriots are five and three. They're five and three. And up next, they got the Seahawks. They got the Legion Boom. I actually want to go look at these stats, man. Like, how are they not, like, undefeated? How are they not 8-0? Tom Brady is knife in the NFL with 2,000 passing yards. Like, who is in front of you? Like, how? 16 touchdowns with three interceptions. Okay, let me look at these receiving. Who going in right now? Julio. Julio going in right now with the most receiving yards. And you have DeAndre Hopkins at second. You have Grunt. You have Dez Bryant. And you have Antonio Brown on down here with only 16 catches and 228 yards? Well, it looks like Julio Jones, DeAndre Hopkins, and Rob Gronkowski are getting all of the catches. They're getting all of the targets. I don't know what you want me to do. Like, Dez Bryant and Antonio Brown are really not doing anything, man. And I believe Antonio Brown is number one on the depth chart, too, but... That boy from Alabama, <laughs> he just be getting open, man. All right, man, so what we're going to do is, I actually want to look at the rushing, too. Like, how, how much are they running the ball? 123 carries. 
So what we're gonna do is we gonna make him. I wanna know who is in front of you. Like, let's look at everything. Like, who is in front of him in his passing yards? And how? Phillip Rivers, Aaron Rodgers, Tyrod Taylor, Blake Bortles. Hey, this boy gonna be legit. If y'all gonna see that Jaguars and Packers game, that boy Paxton Lynch. Bro, Drew Brees, how are you getting beat by these people? What about touchdowns? Who has the most touchdowns? Jameis up here with 17. Brock Osweiler. I don't, guys, I don't get how you have all of these weapons, but you're still not just doing like this absolutely amazing. Like, what about quarterback rating? Like, he has the highest quarterback rating by a lot. Oh, never mind. Oh, hold up. Nah, yours don't count. Okay, Drew Stanton's count because he, look how many, uh, no, he don't have 250. Like, look at the attempts. None of these guys count. Okay. Carson Palmer, these, this is where it counts. At. Okay, so Tom Brady is really second in this. What about pass completions? What about attempts? Are they throwing the ball? Maybe I should give them. Okay, through the second season. Okay, look at these attempts. Where's Tom Brady at? He's way down there. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna give them the Chargers playbook. I mean, if they passing so much, I'm just gonna give them the Chargers playbook and see if Tom Brady can turn it. I mean, he's doing good. I mean, they're five and three. It's not bad, but I actually wanna see who's doing the best. I mean, they're five, they're five and three. It's not bad, but the Bengals over here seven and one. The Pack six and two. The Cardinals over here six and two. Also, I mean five and three is not bad, but you I expect a whole lot more. Also, can I see the who's scoring the most points in this? Can I see? Yeah, this is point four right here. Okay, six. Then six in the league. Hello, no one, two, three, four, five. Then number five. We have 262 points. Okay. Two and two at home. I don't know. I don't know if y'all saw that or not. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna actually gonna give them San Diego, uh, San Diego offensive playbook. San Diego offensive playbook. I'm gonna keep it on the spread, and we are gonna see what happens with that. A year to remember every single week the 2016 NFL MVP. I meant to read that, but Tom Brady has won the MVP, y'all. Tom Brady has won the MVP. I couldn't read all of that. Griffin Murphy wins his first coach of the year award and it's well deserved. So we going in, y'all. I think <laughs> I think that changed everything, y'all. I think that changed everything when I changed that playbook. They're 13 and three. 13 and three. They did not lose another game. 13 and three now. Let's look at these records. Who has the best record in the NFL right now? 13 and three. I changed the playbook, y'all. Look how many points they forced. 543 points. All I had to do was, that's all it took for me to change the playbook. Now let's look at these stats. 4,678 yards, he was still, he went from seven, something like that, to eight. 40 touchdowns, nine interceptions. Guys, if I had that playbook on the whole time, if I had that playbook on the whole time, guys, should I start it over? Should I start a new season? Or should I do it again with the different playbook? Y'all let me know in the comment section, man. But he threw 40 touchdowns, nine interceptions. Remember, he was down. He was down. Let me see who uh who went in over here on the receiving. Who went in? How many were thousand yards receivers do we have? We have Julio Jones. Roll tie, roll, you already know. Let's go. And then we have the Andre Hopkins. Second behind him. Well, ooh, he only beat him by four yards. With less catches, too. But he did have more. 
No, hold up. I'm looking at this wrong. DeAndre Hopkins had the most yards. And he beat Julio Jones by, uh, by four yards and had less catches. Look how many catches these guys had compared to everybody else. Robin Costa was third. Then you have Antonio Bryant and Dez Bryant. Like, Dez Bryant. I know one of y'all had told me. Like, it was a lot of people in the comment section when I did this for Cam Newton. was like, where's Dez Bryant? Where's Dez Bryant? Guys, look at this. 29 catches with 400 yards. With one touchdown. That's what Dez Bryant did. Actually, we don't have Julio Jones and DeAndre Hopkins in the next one, too. The next one that I do. But we will not have. You know what? Now, we're going to remove Antonio Brown and Dez Bryant. Probably going to be Julio Jones, DeAndre Hopkins, and then A.J. Green and Odell Beckham Jr. We're going to see what somebody can do with that. I mean, look at Grunk, though. He did have Grunk, too. Grunk probably took away a lot of the kickers, too. Anyway, y'all, I want to see what's going to happen in the next week. That's similar to the playoffs. Simulate to next week. I just want to simulate one week and see what uh see what actually happens. Up against the 10 and 6 Bengals, let's look at the league schedule. Who else is playing? Who else in these playoffs right now, man? Who else in these playoffs? We got the Bengals and the Patriots. Two teams that I can see in the playoffs. Brother Chargers are right. Seahawks Cowboys. Cowboys in the playoffs. We know Romo. We know Romo. The, with the Dudak show, the Texans and the Chargers. Honestly, y'all, are the Char The last time I did this, the Chargers made it to the Super Bowl. Are the Chargers really that good, or are they just good in man? The Texans, I don't think they making it. They were making it to the playoffs, but they ain't making it to the show. Panthers, Cardinals, I can see both of those. Okay, so let's get to it, man. What we're going to do is we're going to assemble the next week and see exactly where we at. I don't want to simulate all the Super Bowl because I want to see what everybody's doing man. Simulate next week. Did the Patriots beat the Bengals? In the, the Cowboys and Panthers will meet for the NFC Championship. But who's meeting for the AFC? Next week is the Pro Bowl. Come on, come on. Tell me something. Tell me something, news. News, give me some good news. News, give me some good news, man. What? Okay, I'm just going to go look, y'all. It looks like we are done. It looks like we are done, y'all. looks like we lost. Yes, we'll just score. Thirty-eight to twenty. Thirty-eight to twenty. Can I look at? Yeah, let me go look at these stats, man. Let's see what happened. Let's see what actually happened. Tom Brady threw for one touchdown, zero interceptions, only two hundred and fifteen yards. Let me look at the yards. Andy Dalton, two hundred and seventy yards, one touchdown, one interception. Okay, who went in? Who? I told y'all, this is what happened. This is what happened when you don't put AJ Green in it, man. This is what happens when you don't put AJ Green in it. He he torched him. He was mad. He's like, Darius P, you should have had your boy AJ Green in this thing. You should I should have, y'all. I should have. Antonio Brown actually stepped up during this. DeAndre Hopkins, Julio Jones was kept to four catches. Where's Dez Bryant? Bro, he don't, bro, come on, bro. Y'all talking about put Dez Bryant in it. My boy had no, <laughs> he had zero catches. Dez Bryant had zero catches. Y'all, come on now. Come on. Zero catches. Come on, Dez B. Um, sleep, cuh. Who is James? Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to similar to the Super Bowl, man. I cannot believe who actually playing in these playoffs. You got the Bengals and the Texans. You got the Panthers and the Cowboys. Panthers be in there, boy. They be in there, boy. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're just going to similar to the Super Bowl, man. 
see him to Super Bowl. See who's in that bad boy. I'm thinking it's going to be the Panthers and Bengals. What y'all think? The Panthers, look at this. Before I even seen the Panthers and Bengals are both ready for the Super Bowl, baby. That's exactly what I was thinking was going to happen. Okay. I don't want to see him to the... Okay, I guess I might as well see him to the draft, y'all. We're going to see him to the draft. Let's see who won this Super Bowl. I'm... Oh, God. Panthers or Bengals? Who do y'all got in this one? Panthers or Bengals? The Panthers don't have Josh Norman anymore, so I'm thinking AJ Green just torched him. So, guys, it looks like the Panthers have won the Super Bowl, man. The Carolina Panthers will bring home the Lombardi Trophy, and they defeat the Bengals 23-16 in the Super Bowl. Seven sacks for the Panthers. D. Lead them to a win over the Bengals. The Panthers and Bengals are both ready. Okay, that already happened. Nothing like the first, man. So you guys see, the Panthers won the Super Bowl, man. Panthers versus Bengals. Panthers versus Bengals. Super Bowl 2017. Could it be? Who knows, man. Also, guys, Tom Brady retired. It's somewhere in here. It's somewhere in here. Tom, Tom Brady retired. Said he's done. I mean, they should they should have won the Super Bowl anyway. Yeah, Tom Brady walks away from the game as one of the greatest NFL players of all time. Jason Witten also retired, but of course he's old. Anyways, guys, my name is Darius Speed. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to comment, and like, and subscribe. What quarterback should I do next? And what receiver should I choose? Should I add a random back? Should I add a tight end? Or should I do some defensive stuff? Let me know in the comment section, y'all. My name is Darius Speed. Thanks for watching.